Uh, who am I supposed to talk to? So, uh, he tried to kill me. No, he didn't. He just helped the assassin that tried no, to kill us. No, he tried to kill me. And, uh, I think there's a target right there. Seems like a good spot for a firing range, like I, right here. I guess he did try and kill us indirectly. If he doesn't apologize profusely, he might come to regret it. All right, we'll give him a chance to apologize first. Sup? You looking for someone? Preferably someone famous so that I don't have to dig that deep for info? We're looking for an informant named Smudge. Helped out an assassin that tried to kill us? Well, he tried to kill me, not you. He would have had to get through me to get to you. I would have taken the bullet for you. Anyway, we're about to smear you across the pavement. Look, I didn't put the bounty on your head. I'm just a guy people go to when they're trying to find their targets. I never put out bounties or kill the people myself. I'm just good at collecting data. Bounty hunters kind of need guys like me, though. Most of the time, all they have to go on is a name, or even a raw description. I fill in the blanks. We've never needed somebody like you. Well, we do also have this magical compass that just points in the direction of whatever I want it to. Yeah, your job would be easily replaced by a magical artifact. I killed Provolone, in case you haven't guessed it already. Oh no, whatever shall I do? What a great loss to Mojave that a morally bankrupt bounty hunter with a mannequin obsession was just murdered. <laughs> oh. Trust me, tons of guys like that come to me every day, and like 80% don't come back. Too many rookies in this business, if you ask me. I imagine they get culled pretty quickly. So I'm guessing it's the mozzarella family that put the bounty on me. Where can I find them? I could only assume they have been sending hitmen after us for the last two weeks. Yeah, they've kind of been doing a lot of that. Where can I find them? Uh, yeah, I could definitely tell you more about them, but I'm gonna need some caps first. A hundred caps. Payment up front as usual. He wants money. You're just rifling through his pockets without his consent? Yeah, he doesn't have any notes on him or anything. Well, fine, since you don't have any notes in your pocket. Thanks for the cash. Here's what I got. The mozzarella family isn't in the Mojave right now, but they're moving in slowly to take over. There's a drug dealer who just got back into the hype trade named Stilton. He's this guy with... I think he's trying to do a Hispanic accent. <laughs> Stilton? Stilton. <laughs> Again. Anyway, here's the directions to his girl Splat in Westside. Maybe he'll be able to get you an in into the hype trade and eventually the family. No, oh, Stilton's hooking up. How do you just instantly know where Stilton lives, though? I find that curious. Because Stilton's my dealer. Though I mostly just buy buff out. But the other day I found out he was starting to sell hype again. That seems like a dangerous business for Stilton to get into. Probably not the best idea. But we'll take off. We'll be back later, Smudge. Check it out! Jasper's here! Jasper? Yeah! You remember Jasper? Oh, we're the one that killed the guy that wanted us to come take it in the Yarbles. Yeah, we protected him from Mr. Yarbles. Howdy. 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 Don't mind us, just strolling through Westside. We're... Oh, apparently Desmond's got some place to be. <laughs> Desmond has very important places to go, Mike. <laughs> Frank's firearms? Did Frankie relocate? Is this where Frankie's guns and ammo went? Maybe. He changed the name so he wouldn't come by and kill him here. Keep moving. Uh, oh, you're not Frankie. That's a different guy. This place looks like shit. Did you just copy the layout of the other stores? Oh, what are you, some kind of fucking architect? Yes! Get the fuck out of here. I know what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> I guess All it right. doesn't really matter. You don't even have any guns on the shelves! A gun store that's got no guns? Yeah. Is this a front for something? Are you working with the Cheese Mafia, Mr. Frank? Yeah. He admitted it! Murder time! Frank Mozzarella! I hope you weren't important to the plot later. I hope not. <laughs> Come on, then. Whoa! What the hostility for? What was that? <laughs> You're gonna need a steam for that. <laughs> Are you, Desmond? How is that my problem? Yeah, they'll send more assassins after us. We've got to take them all out. All destroy right. the Munster family. Let's try to find Stilton. Somewhere around here. There's a secret door behind Frank's firearms. It's a secret hidden door. We just have to grab the right one. There it is! Mary McBerry's flat is hiding behind Frank's firearms. I never would have found that. A great hideout. Uh, are you Mary McBerry? Hey, hi, hey, hi! <laughs> <laughs> Wanna try some hype? No! So what, you're like dating Stilton? Well, when I first met him, I thought he was so lame. Then he offered me some hype, and now he's like my best friend ever! Yeah. This hype stuff is awesome. I've been turning up the stove to the hottest temperature and touching it with my fingers, and I don't even feel it anymore! <laughs>
<laughs> that sounds like a serious problem. I've done at least six hits today, and the guy on the radio is talking backwards now. <laughs> that might be because the radio is actually the toaster. <laughs> Yes, that would be it. That would be exactly why. Are you okay? You seem a little bit out of it. I've never been better. It's like, it's like, <laughs> ever been kissed by a rainbow? Because that's what it's felt like for the past six hours. <laughs> okay, well, I'm looking for Stilton. He's in the basement. He loves the basement, by the way. Here, now you can get in too. I'm sure he's dying to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> right now. Wait, why is that funny? By the way, isn't it funny how some basements and attics aren't just called rooms? I mean, <laughs> why is that? Who made that up? They're crazy! <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I think maybe you're the crazy one, but... Goodbye, Mary. See ya. And don't forget to check out the basement. You'll really like it. Like, really. Really. Let's pay a visit to Stilton. Did, did I just hear the door lock behind us? Oh, Stilton! Stilton! Hey, buddy, <laughs> how's it, how's it going? It sounds like you've seen better days, Stilton. I hope you were planning on staying a while, because I think Mary just locked you in here with me. What? That's some fine lady friend you picked there, Stilton. Ah, oh, yeah, but she wasn't always like that. It's that damn hype man. It turned her from a sweet little sparrow to a vicious viper. I don't think you can turn from a bird into a snake. Shooting hype is like washing your brain in battery acid. But it apparently gets you a pretty decent eye. Not that I try to do anything. No, you have, Zack. Look, I need to stop the hype train again. Can you help me? If you can get me out of this mess, I'll help you with whatever you want, Maine. I ain't had a good smoke in three days, and it's driving me crazy. I think I got some cigarettes around here somewhere. I probably have some in my backpack somewhere, or at least just like leavings of tobacco. Oh man, what if we can't pick the lock, Zach? What if the lock is too tough even for you? I don't- Stilton, what do we do then? Then maybe Mary left a key somewhere down here by accident. I haven't looked that hard. I have just been kind of, you know, hanging against the wall, hoping something good would happen. You know, usual NPC stuff. <laughs> okay. Breaking the wall a little hard this time, aren't you, Stilton? So, what are you doing down here in the basement, besides relaxing? Well, if you haven't noticed by now, my girl's a bit... possessive. That's partly my fault, though. I let her try some of my hype. She seemed cool at first. We were having a good time until she told me to go downstairs and get some nuka cola. I can understand your temptation. By the time I found out that there weren't no nuka cola down here, she'd already locked the door. Not much of any food down here, really. Kinda super hungry right now, actually. <laughs> hungry and needs a smoke. That's a and double thirsty. whammy. thirsty. But is he horny? <laughs> if so, we've got a place for you, Silton. Why don't you come on down to the Atomic Wrangler? Check that place out. Well, Zach, you want to try your hand at picking the lock? Sure. Oh, got it. Wow, just took you three seconds. Come on, then. Uh, <laughs> Looks like she wasn't in a talking mood. STOP RESISTING! We murdered your girlfriend, Stilton. Ooh, glad to be out of that mess. You've saved me, buddy. Consider me officially off the hype trade. I'm going back to slinging just yet. Wait, wait, we know you also sell buff out. Yeah, and what's the purpose in faking an accent like that? What you talking about, man? This is how I talk. If you got a problem with that, then... Fuck you, man. Don't you know any other voice actors now? Couldn't you just cast Stilton as somebody else? Or just not do the accent? <sighs> but I really want to do the voice. It's a throwback to the original mod. Can you just, like, roll with me on this one? Alright, fine. Yeah. We'll roll with you on it's it. It's a little campy, but it's very endearing. I'll give you that. Okay. I'm being hunted by the Mozzarella family. What do you know about them? The Mozzarella family is an extended crime family first founded in Wisconsin. Since then, <laughs> it's been directed by the family Dawn, the big cheese. Ah, oh, come on. Hype is their biggest seller. It's the source of their whole empire. They already got junkies all across the Northeast hooked on the stuff right now. I would think that Swiss would be their biggest seller. I don't know where you can find their main base of operations, though. 
but the best revenge we can serve now is the takedown of the hype trade before it gets worse. Yeah, if we're gonna stop the hype trade, where do we go? Well, how about we start by destroying monster operations around Vegas? I know four spots where they're selling hype. Hit those first. Ooh, sounds like fun. Kill the main dealer at each place. If they send a hunter after you, then that means that they probably know your face. So prepare to fight. <laughs> Come back to me when you destroy them all. I'm going to chill out here and maybe get something to eat. We'll be back later, Stilton. All right, buddy. Have a good one. <laughs> oh my God. All right, let's go kill four guys and also the people that are probably protecting them. I think this might be uh, that we accidentally did earlier. Oh, never mind. It's still going on. All right, so that's one down. That was simple. Hope the rest of them are just as easy. Mean son of a bitch, where were you on that one? I'm glad mean son of a bitch is on our side. <laughs> if you're the one who is mean son of a <laughs> Monster guy Got him. Just pouring out of the- Yeah, him. fuck you. <laughs> Apparently he was carrying a stick of dynamite and I somehow managed to hit it. Yep, it was the one with blue hair. And lost. Yep, he was trying to throw a frag grenade at me and I hit it in his hand. <laughs> nice. Jerk. You're dead. You just don't even know it yet. Nani? These aren't the gangsters, these are just hype junkies. This one is. Oh wow, nice shot. I'm not talking to you, I'm talking to Hope by the way. Yeah, I figured. Morning. Shut up. Whatever you do, don't eat that food. Plus okay. planning on it. And we'll give Make you the means. Stop the atomic <laughs> she says screaming and running away for her life. Also, we had a shovel for some reason. <laughs> Cut it out, will you? No! You're beautifying the gun store. Oh, oh hang on, hang on, hang on. All right, there we go. So look how easy that was. Maybe they wanted the that bodies outside. That was so easy, hey. Van Graaf Thug, whose name I can't remember. You would think maybe they wanted the bodies outside. Maybe as a warning to everyone, let them know that they packed the biggest punch. I don't think so. Nobody uses energy weapons in this game. <laughs> Stilton! Hey, buddy! What's the story? Hey, good news, Stilton! What's the story, Morning Glory? I just murdered the four people you wanted me to take out! Good on you, Maine. Those are the only majors I know, so I'll keep looking for more. In the meantime, something else has come up. Uh-oh. I got a call from my friend over on that ham radio over there, and he is in trouble. There are some monster goons after his ass. You got to help him. Well, a friend of Stilton is a friend of ours. He wanted to speak to you before his new place over by Lone Wolf Radio was jumped by monsters. You got to get over there quick. Okay. He said that he's locked himself in the closet. The key should be hidden in the toaster. <laughs> Just make sure to clear out the monsters before you get it. <laughs> we'll go protect your friend, Stilton. Yes! Alright, buddy. Have a good one. I do like the fact that Stilton is now the quest giver. The It's a nice callback. Whoa! Looks like we do have a couple of gangsters here. Hold on, hold on. They might not be hostile. Yeah, they're probably hostile. If they weren't before, they are now! Once again, I prove that the grenade launcher beats all other weapons. Oh, that's the hidey hole. You just made a big mistake. Got some gangsters inside of his friend's cellar. Baybell. Oh, he's named that for a cheese too. From your superior, you better read it this time. <laughs> I know that everybody in the family agrees that the last thing the world needs is another radio station. But the boss is sure that we can hijack a signal and start broadcasting advertisements for Hive, and that will really get the cabs rolling. So go take over the station. We got word from the locals that there's a guy living in a little bunker beneath the trailer. Go ahead and serve him some dinner. I recommend 5.56 rounds with a side of microfusion cells discharged directly into the face. What's for dessert, though? I mean, if you've got the main course being 5.56, you got some microfusion cells on the side, What's gonna be the dessert? Uh, the shell casings. Oh, gross. a terrible dessert. Hey, I found the key. <laughs> it actually was in the toaster. No, huh? it was in the toaster. <laughs> Don't rob Stilton's friend. We're not here to take his guns and ammo. We're here to free him. The people that were here before, they robbed him. <laughs> oh, no. As you turn the key in the lock, the old ass door dissolves into dust almost instantly. You're left wondering, could I have seriously just kicked that door open instead? Yes. <laughs> Well, if it isn't the messiah of the wastes. I was gonna warn you about the monsters, uh, but I guess you kinda know by now. 
Thanks for busting me out of this jam, by the way. Stilton told me that you're back to bring down the hype trade. Hell yeah! It's gonna be quite a task. Oh, we're up for it! Uh, who, who, are you, who are you again? Well, I'm DJ. But you can call me DJ. <laughs> so, who are you again? I already forgot. You can call me DJ. I've been roaming the wasteland trying to get a radio station up and running, but it just hasn't happened yet. I, I've lost track. I'm sorry. Uh, who are you again? You can call me Baby Blue Lips. I ran a radio <laughs> station in New Reno before the Cianci <laughs> family ran me out of town. I don't. What is your name? I'm Donnie Donut Boy. <laughs> who are you? Nibbles, God Savior of the Hamster People. <laughs> uh, one more time. <laughs> Junior. <laughs> how do you uh, how do you spell that? I think we both know where this is going. <laughs> so why don't we just move along with this mod, huh? <laughs> so what exactly are we dealing with here? How big is the hype trade now? Right now, the monsters are moving in hard and fast. I guess when you took out Monterey Jack, that pissed off the upper family. Now they're really invested in getting hype into the Mojave. Yeah, they sound cheesed, all right. They're starting out small. But I'm sure that they'll get bigger if we don't put a stop to them right now. These monster guys tend to breed like rad roaches. So do you know how we're gonna fight back against the hype train? I thought it was I thought I thought it was train. It's train. <laughs> You've been calling it the hype train this whole time. Yeah. Well, while I was trapped in the closet, I heard the monsters talk about getting back to the factory, which is apparently near Tumbleweed Farm, according to the small bits of info I picked up. If they're mass producing this hype stuff, then we're in trouble. You gotta find a way to get in there and ruin the main badge. That should set back their progress quite a bit. Well, ruining things is our specialty. Try and see if you can't find any other clues to possible going-ons in the trade. I'll call a few people I know and see what I can learn on my end. With DJ and Stilton on our side, I think there's nothing we can't accomplish. Yeah! So what are you doing in this place besides cowering in fear and peeing your pants? When I heard about the Mojave Music Station, I wanted to meet its owners, since it's so hard for me to find other DJs out here in the West. But when I got to it, it had since been abandoned. Yeah, we killed the last occupants here. I can't imagine why. This is a nice place. So I've been setting up here, and I was planning on changing the station's play roster just a bit. But then these guys attacked. I'm already familiar with the Munsters back east in Wisconsin, so I knew that they meant trouble. So I had to hide. You probably could have found a better hiding place. Yeah. Or just run! Oh, see you later. Bye. Don't forget, Tuesday is always pizza day at the Grab and Gulp. It, is it? They have pizza? What? Tuesday's pizza day? I'm kind of hungry for pizza. Let's go get pizza. Yeah, let's go get pizza. Uh, screw this. Stupid mod. Who cares about the hype trade? Easy to make. Gets users hooked instantly. What more could a drug dealer ask for? But turns out, it's more trouble than it's worth. People can't just chill. They got to stab someone or light something on fire or something. 